Steris Life Sciences is a leading provider of sterilization solutions for pharmaceutical manufacturing applications. In response to the fast-growing demand for contamination control in aseptic material transfer, Steris Life Sciences has developed a new VHP decontamination chamber solution. Introducing the Steris VHP DCA, decontamination chamber atmospheric. The DCA solution is manufactured for GMP-regulated pharmaceutical companies with the requirement to decontaminate materials transferred between areas of different classifications. A typical application is surface biodecontamination of pre-sterilized material packages, such as vial stopper bags, wrapped components, and syringes. The DCA features Steris's non-condensing vaporized hydrogen peroxide technology that ensures six log reduction of bioburden. A unique process for reducing particulates on transferred materials. A short cycle time with proven decontamination result throughout the chamber. A completely independent system that is easy to install and validate. The DCA is designed with the stringent requirements for aseptic drug processing in mind. The design allows your process to reduce bioburden and fulfill the requirements of the current EU and US GMPs. The DCA process cycle consists of three distinctive phases. Preconditioning, VHP decontamination, postconditioning. The preconditioning dehumidification ensures successful VHP exposure in later phases by minimizing humidity and allowing higher concentrations of VHP gas to provide the most efficient and effective cycle. In addition to dehumidification, the preconditioning phase reduces the particulates within process load to match the requirements of a target classified area. This is achieved by flushing the chamber and the load with a strong airflow. The preconditioning can be further enhanced by moving programmable controlled dampers in the chamber ceiling. The air is circulated through a dryer unit and a HEPA filter and back into the chamber. With the particulate monitoring and control option, reduction of particulates inside the chamber is measured with a sensor placed before the HEPA filter. The load preparation phase can be continued until the pre-programmed particulates level is reached. The user can set the particulates level of the chamber to match conditions of the target clean room area. The HEPA filter integrity can be continuously monitored by online measurement. The sensor causes an alarm in case of a HEPA filter malfunction. The VHP decontamination contains two distinctive phases, the conditioning phase and the VHP exposure phase. The conditioning phase is used to increase the amount of VHP inside the enclosure rapidly to a level slightly below the saturation point. The vaporizer flash vaporizes aqueous hydrogen peroxide solution and disperses it into the airstream. Inside the chamber, the VHP gas is circulated by the fan, ensuring even distribution. VHP exposure phase begins when the optimal level of VHP inside the chamber has been reached. In the VHP exposure phase, the level is held steady until the desired reduction in bioburden has been achieved. During the post-conditioning phase, the load is aerated by circulating VHP and air mixture through the catalyzer unit back into the chamber. This system rapidly removes the peroxide from the load and chamber prior to the end of the cycle. The VHP is converted into water and oxygen by using a built-in catalytic converter system. For maintaining assured operator safety, the chamber peroxide monitoring system does not allow opening of the door until the VHP concentration has reached a safe level. The new Steris VHP Atmospheric Decontamination Chamber provides GMP-regulated sterile drug manufacturers with the reliable Steris VHP technology for six-log reduction of resistant spores, unique particulate matter reduction process, short cycle times, and independent decontamination solution for easy installation and validation. Contact our experts for more information. We are glad to help.